Hi, I'm John Riccatello, former CEO of Electronic Arts Incorporated. Over the past few years, EA has received a lot of complaints from its customers, specifically about our poorly optimized origin service, our always on DRM, and us nickel and diming customers by releasing DLC that you unlock with money rather than skill. Well, I'm here today to explain exactly why the company went forward with all of these decisions. You see, Electronic Arts doesn't give a shit about its customers. We don't! We have more power than any other publisher in the video game industry, we own more developers than anyone else in the video game industry, and we can buy any score we want to off of IGN. Hell, we can completely control the video game market if we want to. We own the Madden series, the FIFA series, and so many other sports series, and all we need to do is just make a slight graphical upgrade and people will eat that shit right up. And as for our big AAA titles that actually have some level of originality to them, well, we don't care about those either. As long as we're making money, we're happy. Remember Mass Effect 3's terrible ending? You know, the one that absolutely no one liked? Well, we rushed them to complete the game in only two years as opposed to the three that it usually takes. Best part is, you guys blamed them. And don't forget about Dead Space 3, the game that completely forgot about the whole survival horror aspect of the game, and instead had $50 of on-disc DLC and microtransactions to upgrade your weapons. <laughs> You know, we made so many bad business decisions with that game, we were actually thinking of canning the whole series. No, seriously! And that brings us to our latest game, SimCity, that requires an always-on internet connection even for the single-player mode. Best part? During the first week it was so congested, no one could even play the game. They couldn't even connect to any other games on Origin. Yes, I know you guys voted it as the lowest rated item on Amazon, but we still sold 1.1 million units within the first week, so we don't care. Now that whole debacle is what caused me to step down as CEO of the company, and you weren't ever going to buy an EA game ever again! That is until we released our Battlefield 4 trailer, causing you to forget, lavishing praise on how good it looks despite the fact that it's the same shit all over again. Ha! You're such perfect little sheep, aren't ya? See, that's how we do business here at EA. Sure, it's a dumb business model, but we'll still be making money years from now, and honestly, there's nothing you can do about it. Unless you stop buying our games. But you're not smart enough to do that. You know why? Because you bought our games in the first place! Electronic Arts. Because fuck developers, fuck the customers, and fuck you.